Canada did send some military assets to Europe today. Canadian warship set sail from Halifax on its way to the Mediterranean Sea. It's part of a NATO-led mission aimed at demonstrating solidarity and strength. CTV's Jonathan McKinnis has more. Last minute hugs and well wishes sent the crew of HMCS Fredericton off on a six month deployment. We have a Bristol board with all the months and she marks it off every day. Okay. Leading seaman Donald O'Leary is leaving for his second mission in two years. Saying goodbye doesn't get easier. Leaving family is always tough, but um, you know it's the job we signed up for him and you know we know it's it's coming. We've had lots of time to prepare for it. The Fredericton will sail with HMCS Montreal and HMCS Asterix to the Mediterranean as part of Operation Reassurance. There absolutely is a heightened sense of urgency. Russia's invasion of Ukraine has raised tensions in the region. The three Canadian ships will support NATO's efforts in the area. They'll uh, monitor Russian activity on a daily basis. Uh, they will do exercises and training to make sure that we're interoperable with our allies uh, and that we're ready for any emergency. That is making these goodbyes a little more emotional. Keegan Dawson has been in the Navy for 25 years, and this will be his longest deployment. We've got a great crew, you know, and that when you have a great crew, it makes everybody's job a lot easier. Um, so there will be a lot of probably heavy hearts today but over the next few days everybody will rebound and uh, we'll start focusing toward the the mission that we're going on. HMCS Fredericton is scheduled to return at the end of July. The mission could be extended if needed. They will get a break halfway through the six-month tour when the Fredericton pulls into port for maintenance. The crew will be able to come home for a week to visit family and friends. John. Okay Jonathan thank you.